Hey everybody. So, um, what's the craze? Shelly blooms, right? Shelly art blooms. So, um, I'm really no good at it because I never had the right paint where I live. I couldn't get it, but I had somebody shop for me out of town and, um, I finally have it, but I'm not doing that today. I haven't even tried one yet with the right paint. But what I'm doing, because I want to make magnets, you know, with the cabochons. And, oh, those are going to be so pretty. I'm very excited. So, how I'm going to do this, you're not going to believe this. But this is what I'm doing. This is Artist Loft White. Uh, mixed with Floetrol. And this is Liquitex Basics Quinacridone Magenta mixed with Floetrol. Two to one. Uh, this is Liquitex Basics Medium Magenta. Oh, whoops, that didn't work, did it? Always a boo-boo when you're Go, doing this live, right? And this is Amsterdam Titanium White and Water. And all I'm doing, well, I'm going to make a, since I'm just using this for magnets, I'll just go wide on that, right? And then all I do is blow it out. I'm not going to stretch it, so this works to make these if you're just looking to make magnets or use the skins for something else, right? Well, that one was kind of a mess. <laughs> okay, let's do another one color we want to do now. Let's do, again, Amsterdam, I mean, Artist Loft White mixed with Floetrol. Um, let's do uh, turquoise. Ooh, I haven't done a turquoise one. Let's do, um, what color do I use with turquoise? I don't know. Um, should we use, uh, hmm, that might be pretty. Cerulean blue. How about that? We'll do some cerulean blue. See how fast this is, too? And then I just let these dry. And then I'll be able to attach them to the cabochons. To make magnets. I'll show you all my other magnets I just made in a minute. Again, this is titanium white, Amsterdam titanium white with water. Oh, I got some pretty cells in there, even though I didn't blow that out good. But, you know, also, I've been taking a stick. I'll show you real quick. I don't want this to be a long video, but, um, and I've been kind of running my stick through it. You know how you wreck a ring pour? <laughs> wreck a bloom. However, Shelly wrecks blooms, right? And that makes really pretty designs in it. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that one's nice, just like it is. But I'm going to do that. Okay. So now let's blow out this other one. Oh, my. Oh, that's kind of sinking in there. I wonder why. It didn't sink in my other ones. Oh, that's a different paint. That's deco art. That turquoise is deco art satin oh dear this one might not work 
just because I'm videoing it. Ha ha ha. Okay, let's try it anyway. Look at the cells. Wow, we that's so cool. Why can't I do that on a regular bloom? You know? I mean, I know I'll get it eventually, but like, I would like to do it like today. But I, I'll get it. I will get it. And so I just wanted to show you. Let me bring you down for a close up. Hang on one sec. Okay, here's the purple one. Actually, that one is, um, 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 it is Blacrylics Fluorescent Violet with Dioxazine Purple, I think. Anyway, here's the green one. This one I just did black and lime green, and I got all that yellow, but look at the cells, you guys. Isn't that neat? Here's the blue one. Oh, it's my favorite. This is Prussian blue and ultramarine blue. Isn't that pretty? Look at the gorgeous cells. Come on, focus. Focus. Hang on. There we go. Look at that. I'm going to put a cabochon right there in that one. That's so gorgeous. Here's the pink one. This was uh, Quinacridone Magenta and Medium Magenta by Liquitex Basics. Is this fun or what? And then look what this one did. Ooh, I got cool lacing on that one, didn't I? That was with DecoArt Satin Deep Turquoise. And <laughs> Cerulean Blue by Dec uh, Liquitex Basics. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That is so cool. So, yeah, so here's some of my other magnets. Like, look at these I made right here. These are just off pores I've done. Look with the gold. Ooh. And then these with the really pretty bright blues. And then I have all these that I've made. Look at these gorgeous black and gold ones. Is this fun or what? Oh, this is just... Look at these. I like these right here. Isn't that neat? <laughs> Oh, I love the metallic ones, too. The metallics just turn out so pretty. Um, I like those. I like them all, but, you know, that was a that was a, a balloon dip, a balloon roll that I took from. Look at that. Oh, here's gold and white. You see that shimmer? Oh, beautiful. Purple, metallic. Anyway, oh, I like those. Isn't that neat? Anyway, that's what I'm doing. I don't know how, what you guys are doing. Great stuff, I know. I watch all of you all the time. So, that's where I'm at. And I got a few more to do here in different colors for different people. And so I'm going to get back to it. Just wanted to show you what I'm doing. You can make blooms for other things if you don't have to stretch them with just your regular paints regular paints not kidding you just saw me do it that's what I did okay oh that blue is my favorite or is that turquoise my favorite I love them all okay see you next time have fun